Hello there, this is Dave Allen for Much Honor Questions and today we're going to have a look at a better way of getting our videos into iTunes. Now the manual way of doing it is to drag it up into iTunes, hunt for the video, find out where it's gone to and you'll probably find it's gone into Home Videos. And then when you've done that you've got to go into Options, you've got to change this from Media Kind. If it's a TV show, put it onto that one there. If it's a movie, get it out of Home Videos and into Movies. And then you have to go into this section here, put in the show title, season number and the episode number and click on OK to get it to where it should be. And that is a bit of a faff, isn't it? So we're going to look at a better way of doing that. And I found a nice little application called i6 or IVI and it's very easy to use. All we've got to do is drag this file and drop it into here. And as you can see, it's given a bit of a guess as to what this video is called. This TV show, you can change it on here from TV show to movie or home video, or whatever else. And that's the thing that's going to say where it's going to go to in iTunes. Now we know that this is a TV show, so let's put that there. I don't know what this pass through means. Don't need to touch that, so I'll leave it as it is. And you can also change the format on there and just leave it as I leave it as standard, whatever it says it's going to be. And that's usually just grand. Now it's made a guess of what it's called and it's actually got it wrong. So I'm going to double click on that. And as you can see from the here, it thinks it's called a bridge, which it is, but it's not that bridge. It is this bridge. So I'm going to click on that one there. And I've got a whole lot of description on there. I've got the names of actors and sometimes it gives you the directors and the producers as well. I don't know where it gets this information off the internet, but it finds it and it does a good job of it. So we've got the right information in there now, so we can close that now. Now all we need to do is to click on this button here, convert. So I'm going to, it thinks about it for a little bit of a minute or two and then it does the conversion very, very quickly and then it'll put it into iTunes. That's what it says it's currently exporting the file. Once that's done, you can click on clear completed. You can do more than one file at a time. So you've got a conversion queue there and you can convert all. Let's go now and have a look in iTunes and see what we've actually got in here. So. Normally it would have gone into home videos, but this time it's actually gone where it's supposed to go into TV shows. This is the one I've just put in there. This is episode two. So the details went in there, the name of the series, the episode number and some details for the episode. If there's a title for the episode, that'll go in there too. And it wasn't that easy. A whole lot easier than doing it manually. So this is Dave Allen for Back to the Questions and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye bye now. If you found this tutorial useful, please click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe to make sure that you get more of these tutorials. I can also be found over on Google+. Have a look for me under the name of David Allen with the Gold.